in this lesson we are going to see what is there inside a processor so the main units that are present inside the processor are the arithmetic and logic unit the register file and the control unit these are the main units apart from other thing all of these components inside the processor would again be connected with each other through a through a set of wires again which are running between the different uh, units so this register file is a set of registers so suppose if there are 15 registers or oh sorry 16 registers so they will be from 0 r0 they could be named like this r0 to r15 so these are a set of 16 registers and they are collectively known as a register file okay these provide the local storage inside the processor they are high speed elements they provide the local storage for the operands to be stored for the data to be stored for any temporary result to be stored from here the data can be taken to the arithmetic and logic unit so the operation can be performed on them and then the result can be stored back into the register file and all the operations of the processor as well as the other units in the uh, computer system are controlled by the control unit so what is the arithmetic and logic unit do so most of the computer operations are executed in the arithmetic and logic unit to perform that operand operation the operands are brought into the processor and the operation is performed so what are operands by operands we mean the the data on which that particular operation has to be performed so these operands they will be either in the memory from where they will be brought into the processor or they could be alternatively available in the registers so they will be taken to the alu and the operation will be performed and as specified over here these operands are stored in registers which are high speed elements and can store one word of data what is a control unit do so all the operations of the alu the memory the input output devices they are all coordinated by the control unit so if there are any input output transfers taking place between the input output devices and the processor or data transfers between the processor and the memory so timing signals will be generated by the control unit to manage this so there are a large set of control lines which are also collectively known as the control bus which will carry the signal for the timing and synchronization between the components so these were the basic units which are present inside the processor 